G'day YouTube, this is just a quick video to show you guys how to install a Nintendo 64 emulator in Linux Mint 16. Now it's quite easy to do and I'll just show you how to uh, really do that. So first of all I'll show an example of it working. So I run a what seems like a script but it's just a command program and uh, it pops up there. So here we go, I'm not sure if you can hear that but I've got the classic game Zelda Ocarina of Time going. And uh, it's, yeah, no, great game, but uh, I guess the point of this video is to show you how to install this. Now I could just uh, run through the motions, click start, do all that, and play my game, which I might do for half a second. Uh, yeah, and let that load in. And the controls are, are, are pretty much, you know, up, down, left, right, A, Z, S, X, shift, control, that sort of thing. Oh, it's gone to the very start of the uh, game, so I won't do what, what, too much worry about that right now. So, okay, so now what you need to do is install a program named Muppin Plus 64. And in order to install that, the best way probably is to go through the terminal. So open up a terminal, control, alt, T, and type in sudo apt get, whoop sudo apt-get install moppin64 plus uh, typos everywhere today hit enter, throw in your password and mine's already installed the latest version, newest version as you can see there but uh, that's really all you need to do, uh, follow the prompts click yes, click enter and then that will install now from that point this is actually a command based uh, Software, so there is a front end I think called Cute Muppin, but in terms of actually just running games nice and easily, all you need to do is type in the name of the program. So you can see here Muppin 64 plus space, and then the directory where the actual game is located. So as you can see, mine's located under the download Zelda Ocarina .z64. So there you go. Then you just uh, open up that, and there you go. And then you're playing. Nintendo 64 games. Alright, cheers guys, thanks for your time, hope you've enjoyed, disclaimer down the bottom, and uh, have a good day. Uh, please subscribe, just all of that, please leave a comment, and uh, yeah, thanks again. Cheers, take care.